What's up friends? It's been a while. It's actually been a long while. I'm having a hard time focusing on YouTube this summer, if I'm being fully honest. But I got something cool to share with you guys today. So here I am. This is Burnt Sienna, the adventure van. You guys know all about her, right? Got a few antlers back there. But I'm gonna go up the street right here and I'm gonna show you my latest addition to the Shed Crazy family. And I think you guys are gonna be stoked because I am freaking stoked. So let's go check this thing out. Look at this beauty right here. <laughs> yes. So uh, many of you may know, I have been in search of a small camper for a long time. And I uh, wanted to buy the right one. So I've been holding out for the perfect trailer and I think I finally found it. This is, I think it's a 1975 Surfside fiberglass camper. It's a 14 footer technically, even though the body is only 13 feet. And you guys gotta see the inside. Maybe. I dropped my keys. Check this out. It's got the bunk beds. This one drops down and it makes the back of the couch. So it's just held up by these latches here. I got the stove, sink, fridge, heater, everything. Then this is a dinette that converts to a bed. So I already ordered new seat cushions for this, a new trim piece for that, that is on the way. Also got a new piece of carpet that's supposed to be here anytime. A couple spare tires, we put new tires on it, packed the bearings and brought her home. So I am so stoked to have this thing right here. 1500 pounds is all. I can pull it with the van or pull it with my truck, but I am stoked. So. What I need to know is this. What should I A, name it, because it's gotta have a name. I got Burnt Sienda, I got the Tundi 400, got all that covered, but what am I gonna name this thing? So help me out, folks. What's a good name for it? Also, I need to know what you guys think I should do to it as far as upgrades go, because I'm definitely gonna be doing some upgrades to it in here. Um, I don't know what though, I like to keep it kind of vintage looking, kind of throwback. So I don't wanna go too far away from the original here, but, there's definitely gonna be a few upgrades done. Um, maybe things like paint these cabinets. I could even rebuild these cabinets, I don't know. Um, I might get rid of that fridge right there. I have a sweet little Dometic um, powered cooler that would probably work really well in here or else I can just use coolers. Got some tape ordered for all these seams and everything. My buddy Brian actually bought this trailer and he was just gonna flip it and I, I middlemaned him. I jumped in the deal because I wanted it bad. So I'm pretty stoked to have it, but supposedly everything works in it. The stove, the sink, uh, you can hook up to power. There's a battery system for 12 volt for the light. So I'm stoked, I'm so stoked for this thing. The main thing I love about it is that it's so lightweight, I can pull it anywhere that I go. There also I found online a lift kit so you can just put a little spacer in between uh, the top of the axle and the body, the frame of the trailer, and you can get about three inches of lift with basically just by bolting it on, so. Anyway, I'm excited. Let me know in the comments what I should name this thing and what I should do with it. If I should keep it the original paint or if I should paint the outside or wrap it. I had a couple companies reach out saying that we should wrap it and maybe some logos and stuff. So anyway, that's the update on what I going on, got going on with this trailer. Now it's time to go home. I got a few things to do uh, before I head up north this weekend for an event. But yeah, that's life. That's where I'm at. New carpet is in. Uh, got a little ripple in it right there. It needs a little bit. I think I got to cut a little off. Just kind of smooth it out a touch. But uh, overall, it looks pretty good. These are the new dinette cushions. I think I already showed them to you, I can't remember. This is a really cool mirror. This shows you how tall I am. So this is me standing full height. Um, my head touches the mirror, I mean the roof. But yep, so slip covers for those are coming. Uh, I'm gonna do something with this, I'm not sure what yet. May pull off the countertop and put a new range in there, but yeah, that's what's going on. Hey, River, what are you doing? Coming to help me? Trying to rain. Come on, baby. Give it to me. So yeah, that's where we're at. A little bit of an update. Anyway, this trailer, this video has pretty much just been trailer stuff and I hope you guys enjoyed it. I hope you've enjoyed following along. I'm super excited for this thing. I know I've been really absent on YouTube lately and every video it seems like I'm telling you guys that I'm gonna be around more. The truth is, is that uh, it's just hard in the summertime when I'm not hunting a lot and when I feel like I don't have anything to film, but um, I am excited for the hunts and I promise once the hunts get here, we're gonna be more regular 
for now I got a toddler trying to climb up my leg. So I'll catch you guys on the next one. Thank you for buying merch and apparel. I do have some people to thank who bought it, so I will be in the house editing this video and doing that next. So trying to rain. Come on, baby. Give it to me. So yeah, that's where we're at. A little bit of an update. Anyway, this trailer, this video has pretty much just been trailer stuff, and I hope you guys enjoyed it. I hope you've enjoyed following along. I'm super excited for this thing. I know I've been really absent on YouTube lately, and every video it seems like I'm telling you guys that I'm going to be around more. The truth is, is that uh, it's just hard in the summertime when I'm not hunting a lot and when I feel like I don't have anything to film. But um, I am excited for the hunts, and I promise once the hunts get here, we're going to be more regular. For now, I got a toddler trying to climb up my leg. So I'll catch you guys on the next one. Thank you for buying merch and apparel. I do have some people to thank who bought it. So I will be in the house editing this video and doing that next. So bye. All right, so these are the people who bought apparel from my store uh, in this past uh, couple weeks that it's been since I've made a video, which honestly, you guys, this has been my longest break from YouTube ever. And I can't say that I've enjoyed it, um, but I am really excited. I have some big news coming for the fall. You know what, I'll finally, I'll just go ahead and tell you. I'm hiring my little brother as a full-time camera guy and we are committed to making a pile of good videos this fall. I'm so excited, we're gearing up for that now. We're getting gear and schedules figured out, hunts planned, and uh, it's gonna be big. We're gonna do more and better videos than we've ever done before on this channel this fall. I'm excited for it. So anyway, here's the people I need to thank. First up, Raimundo Henry, my guy. Uh, WMAT, the guy makes some really cool shed hunting videos, so thank you, buddy. Thanks for buying uh, some stuff. Um, Andrew Kaiser, thank you. Colin Smith, Zachariah Warwick, Megan Moore, James Booth, Dalton Groening, Amy Bowen, Marissa Kitteridge, Colby Cook, Quentin Johnson, James Draper, formerly of Bro Outdoors. Does that still exist? Thanks, James. Britton Porter, Caleb Waters, Dwayne Troyer, Tanya Tapia, Tony Shields, Ian Frazier, Calvin Parasol, James Griego and Tyrell Williams. So thank you guys. Uh, just to let you know, we do have these hats on the site um, and I have decent stock on them. I made them 20 bucks, a little bit cheaper than usual because they're just a foamy like a trucker hat, but they're a great lake hat, an awesome summer hat, uh, really like cool. I like them. So anyway, I'm gonna be going to some total archery events, headed to Colorado this week uh, to shoot a total, total archery challenge event. And I'm going to bring you guys along with me because I want to get back to the vlogs. So thank you guys for watching this video. Thanks for following along. Hope you enjoyed it. Thanks for buying apparel. We'll see you next time.